Hello everybody, welcome to my channel. My name is Dominique. If this is your first time stopping by, thank you for stopping by. And if it is not, thank you for coming back. And this is gonna be a really quick wig review. I'm reviewing this lovely lady right here. Uh, her name is BS206. <laughs> and uh, she is made by Isis. This is part of the Brown Sugar Collection. They have some of my very favorite wigs. I can usually find something with them and be very happy with my selection. So yes, I decided to get this one. I found it at a local beauty supply store, which is a good place to find new wigs and kind of see what's out there. But there are way cheaper options to purchase this one online i discovered later on and i'll put the link in the description bar if you were interested in purchasing this wig but i am in love so even though i'm upset that there was a bit of a price difference i'm still really excited about finding a new wig that i really love because i'm very indecisive um i have a hard time finding ones that i could not only wear and look pretty natural but ones that I can wear for a while I like to get longevity out of my wigs even though they're synthetic I still like to pick uh, pick wigs that I can wear and maybe style and you know I just I really like to get my money's worth and I know I can speak for a lot of us when I say that so I went ahead and got something I was first I was in the market for something straight but I decided that I wanted something with a little bit more texture because with those they definitely last longer than a straight wig especially if it's synthetic synthetic wigs uh, when they're straight sometimes they begin to get tangled and it's easier to tell than when you're getting something like this that has a little bit of a curl to it the last one that I had was really curly so this is a little of a change a little bit of a change and it's also shorter than what I would usually get but I am in love with this wig um, this is pretty much straight out of the package with a little bit of you know putting my fingers through it and I also put some concealer on the part um, I like the fact that the part was pretty much already done I didn't have to do much tweezing I still may go in and do a little bit just to widen it some and um, here at the beginning of it I might I might do some but I might not um, and if I don't I think it'll be fine I don't think it's a big deal so as I mentioned I found this girl at a local beauty supply store I was immediately drawn to the color of this wig it's not too orange it's not too red it's right in the middle which is just where I like it it looks like it could be a natural color actually a color that I've been eyeing um, and thinking about dyeing my hair another thing that I really like about it is that it has the deep root and this is a plus because I don't want to dye my hair that's why I'm wearing a wig so with this if my hair sticks out a little bit that's okay because it ends up looking like it's just part of the wig and you know what I'm saying I mean I don't know if I'm being confusing but that is a plus for me that it has a dark root so it can excuse my oversized shirt i'm still wearing maternity clothes some of you may know that i just gave birth to a beautiful baby boy uh, about a month ago that's why i haven't been making any videos but yeah so i haven't done the whole mommy makeover thing yet and i'm still in between which is another video i'll show you about that too because weight loss is another thing that i'm going to be taking on soon but anyway yes um, back to the wig <laughs> so this is a style mix it's not a hundred percent synthetic hair it's not a hundred percent human hair it's right in between which gives a gives the hair a great texture I like it because with the synthetic it holds a curl really well and with it not being human it's not an arm and a leg when it comes to crosswise so um, this is just a great buy if you ask me. It's about $40 online. You can't beat it. It looks like you pretty much just came out of a salon. Um, if you style it the right way. If you get really meticulous with your tweezing and your concealing, all of that, it really can look like it's your hair. So I didn't go all super out and try and make it look like my hair. I didn't lay it. Not today. I just really wanted to get on here and share my excitement for this new hair that I have. And yes, it's a wig. <laughs> so yeah, and I'm just going to show you the side and the back.
and that's that um another thing about this wig that's awesome is that you can put a little bit of heat on it i like to put heat right here just to lay it down especially since this part is kind of hidden i like to show the part as much as possible so i would just put a little bit of heat right here maybe like a wand wand it down like that and boom you have a beautiful style i think this wig is good for at least um if you're wearing it every single day i would say it might work for like a month if you take really good care of it maybe even longer i'm just maybe hard on my hair like i wouldn't lay down in it or you know but sometimes you have a day and you don't want to take your wig off because you're not ready yet that's like the maybe the 10th date maybe by the 10th date they can see your they can see your uh your wig cap but yeah <laughs> and